Hello guys, Nato Ace here, and this will be my follow-up on Ask Catchem winning the Coronation Tournament and becoming a Pokemon champion for 25 years. So 25 years in the making, finally he won. So with that said, Pokemon Company in Japan announced the future plan for the anime, and I'm surprised that they're even talking about this on the US official website such as Twitter, YouTube and their official Pokemon website. So I'm surprised, kind of different from direction for the business because normally in the past, if I remembered, like the American side will not even talk about it and like, oh, it's only about the Japanese, but no, apparently they're just saying, hey, look, you know, in Japan, things are changing in 2023 and beyond. So they even said that keyword beyond. So what am I talking about and what happened? So in the latest episode of Pokemon Ultimate Journey, they reveal a lot of information what's going to happen. So. The elephant in the room for this one is, yes, after 25 years, Ash Ketchum, or Satoshi in Japan, is hanging up his cap. Because the new series that's going to be based on Violet and Scarlet will have two new protagonists. Yeah, so there will be a new protagonist for that region. So you might question so what's happening with Ash. So according to Pokemon Company, that there will be, starting in January of 2023, an 11 episode, basically Ash, Misty, and Brock will go to a journey to all the region, and basically the title sort of is Pokemon Road to Pokemon Master. So 11 more episodes focusing on Ash. So the story, the arc with Ultimate Journey, I think it conclude Chloe and go they conclude their arc so now it's going to be Ash trying to go to the road for going to be a Pokemon master so that is interesting and then in April of 2023 it's going to be the new series with a new protagonist so that's interesting there so again thoughts for this one interesting Finally, after 25 years, the anime studio said, you know what? It's time for a change. It's time to retire Ash. It's time for somebody new. Because believe it or not, the reason why it's Ash all the way for these 25 years, there was a rumor, believe it or not, long time ago, that after the Indigo League arc going to Gold and Silver, it will be a new protagonist. It was supposed to be Ethan and Chris. But they decided, you know, we're going to just keep, keep it with Ash because it's going to make more sense. Just keep it consistent, and a lot of people like Ash. So they've been doing that time and time again until the Gala region. And yes, like I said before, the reason he keeps losing on the final tournament because so keep going to have a reason to oh I'm gonna try this again. And at a time, a lot of the people, the upper management said as long Ash makes them money on the anime, guess what? We're gonna keep him. But then finally they said, you know what? It's been 25 years. He's already a champion twice. And of course, like I said, in the Gallery region arc, the direction was way different. Rather than, oh, I'm going to get eight badges and join the final eight tournament, it's more of, oh, I need to build up my tournament points until I reach the top eight for the Coronation Top Eight Tournament. You can see it there. So, again, I'm going to say props to Pokemon Company for doing this. It is something new. It's going to be interesting once the new arc comes in Japan. Again, remember, they're not worldwide with it. They're not simultaneously. So in the West, there's still a long way to go to finish Pokemon Ultimate Journey. That's why they said in the Pokemon.com website is 2023 and beyond. So chances are, again, it depends on how Netflix goes. The international version of the new Pokemon Scarlet and Violet anime it could be 2024. Yeah, it might suck, but just how it is right now. Maybe in the future, there's going to be a different approach for the business. But until then, this is how it is. It's been in the past. So it is what it is. I think it's great. They finally are changing. They're finally trying to do something new. I like it. So we just have to wait and see what happens. So those are my thoughts for the new Pokemon animated series info that's going to be in 2023 and beyond. So you got to keep in mind, again... Most of this news is in Japan because they're almost done with Ultimate Journey. In the West, 
way far. It's still a long way to go. And even the new voice actress for Ash, even what's happened again,、yeah, you know, it's an honor to voice Ash. And I'm proud of it. You know, great speech. I was on Twitter. But it is what it is. Time for a change. So, with that, I'll see you guys later.